We begin at five with new details in the case of the Norton Shores woman convicted of torturing and killing her son. We have learned today Shonda Vander Ark is trying to keep her parental rights even after she goes behind bars for the rest of her life. 13 on your side's Lauren Baker joins us now from the newsroom and Lauren, what are officials saying today? Well, Juliet and Elena, Shonda Vander Ark is asking a court to allow her to still make certain decisions about her one child that is a minor even after she's sent to prison. Now, this all started when officials were responding to that initial scene when Vander Ark's son Timothy was found dead at their home in July of 2022. It was then when Child Protective Services was called in because a minor was living in the home. Out of fear of future harm, officials say CPS filed a petition to remove the child from the home and place them into the care of relatives. And since then, Vander Ark has been fighting the possible termination of her parental rights because she will spend the rest of her life behind bars. If she is allowed to keep those rights, she'd be able to make decisions on things like how often her child could visit her in prison and who would take the child on a permanent basis. But if she loses those rights, it would allow the relatives to fully adopt the child. Now, this hearing actually began yesterday after she was sentenced to life in prison and continued today. We, of course, will be following this case to see if she loses those rights. Juliet and Elena, back to you.